Good evening, I'm Paul Martino. A man's been charged after being accused of sexually assaulting two women while working at a residential care center, Life Care Hospital. It's a behavioral health facility in Wilkinsburg. Pam Serrano, live tonight at the Allegheny County Jail. She's got more on this. Pam. Yeah, Paul, we now have copies of two criminal complaints filed against an employee at Life Care Hospital in Wilkinsburg. In one of these criminal complaints, detectives charge that the uh, male employee there is charged with sexual assault of one patient in the other criminal complaint. They allege that he is charged with the indecent sexual assault of another. Here is a look at his mugshot. He is from Turtle Creek and is in 56 years old. His name is Adesil Solowin and he is facing a long list of charges in the criminal complaints just filed back to back. Those charges include rape, involuntary deviant sexual intercourse, sexual assault, and institutional sexual assault in one case. In the separate criminal complaint, Solomon was charged with unlawful restraint and indecent assault of another patient. The man charged with the list of crimes that allegedly happened during the time he was an employee at Life Care in Wilkinsburg. In one case, a female patient told detectives in the criminal complaint that he forced himself on her without her permission. She was given a dose of sleeping aids by a female nurse that she was prescribed when shortly after he would come into her hospital room and force himself on her. In that second criminal complaint, another female patient said Solowin, who worked as a nurse's aide, would slip into her room, touched her under her clothes, and when she tried to leave the room, he stood in the way. When she got loud, Solowin left the room and then was allegedly sent home for the evening, according to that criminal complaint. Now, we did try to reach sources at Life Care Hospital, and we were told that no one would be available until Monday. In the meantime, 56-year-old Adesil Solowin is here at the Allegheny County Jail on $50,000 bond. We are live tonight. Pam Serrano, KDKA TV News.